So today we're shooting demo portions of our videos. I played Kawhi's, I played Yamaha's, I played Roland, and I played Casio. And I have a surprise standout, this one. Stick around. Hi, Ted Barsley with Alamo Piano Galleries. If you haven't already, please subscribe to this channel. I love building up membership. And also shop our store at alamopianogalleries.com. We've got tons of pianos for you to look at, every kind of make and model you can imagine. Go in there and check it out. Today, as I mentioned, we were shooting videos. And uh, part of the video process is the crew, they line up six or seven keyboards and you go in, you play, you play, you play, you play, and then you go in, you take your time and you talk about them. Well, one of the standouts, because I was playing, the crew was so efficient as you, normal, and it puts the pressure on me. I'm playing these pianos, and I'm trying not to make much of, uh, trying not to make any mistakes, number one. But the other thing is I'm trying not to make any opinions about which one, because I save that for the conversation. But when I'm playing, I come across this piano. Though, what model is this? This is a Kawhi. 701, their Concert Artist Series, CA701 model. And it, the reason why it stands out for me is obvious when I looked at it, it's like, I remember this model, not that long ago we shot a video, and this is gonna be included in some comparative videos. But it was just a standout today, it got me so excited for this one simple reason. This keyboard has a competition grand sample in it that when they first, you know, brought that sound out, I was just so amazed that a digital piano could sound so fantastic. And the other things that are really kind of subtle, this, this piano has the Grand Field 3 action on it, and it also has the ivory touch and ebony touch type keys, so it's really, really great. And it has the SK rendering, which is Kawhi's experimental, and it's their top of the line, nine foot grand piano. This one has been sampled with the Competition Grand as one of the sounds as well as the Concert Grand. And then they have the uh, different versions of the SKs. There's the SK5 with a different kind of EQ on it. It tends to go great and pop. All those sounds are on here. And this keyboard plays and sounds like a, it's, it's really great. It has like the graded uh, weighted hammers on it. So it's it plays almost like a grand piano. It certainly it plays better than any upright you've ever played. Uh, the, the other thing I like about it, it has good polyphony, 256K, and it also has Kawhi's virtual artisan piano app. And what this allows you to do, there's 20 different settings on there, hammer action key, all kind of let off stuff. I've never messed with it other than making a piano um, kind of funky in a different way. Uh, but you can, there's a ton of parameters. You can save them and store those pianos as well. There also has six speakers which are displaced. They have two woofers, two top sides with ports, and then they also have some spatial uh, little like one or two inch kind of uh, tweeters that are in there. That along with this multicolored LCD, five inch, just makes it a real dream. There are other models that are compared in the same price range. This thing is an exciting piano. It got me all excited about playing piano again. And why don't we go and have a listen to it? What I've really focused on here are just those acoustic piano sounds.
Now that you heard those piano sounds, I, I hope that this excitement is coming through the audio to you because I was really, really infatuated with the play, the touch, the tone, and the expressiveness on this piano. I, I played short passages, but I tell you what, I just got re-excited about this instrument. And I want to remind you, we have stores in Ohio, we have stores in Michigan, we have a store in St. Louis and in Kansas City, and there's three in Texas. Make sure you go in and ask for, by name, I want to play a Kawhi CA701 that Ted is talking about. And I'll look for you in our next video. Thank you for sticking around.